I'd now like to introduce Kashalya Adhikari from the Department of Electrical and Computer Engineering, Localization Accuracy Evaluation in Cellular Networks. I'm going to ask you all to, take, to think about a terrible situation, that you are having a heart attack and there is no one near you. With a lot of effort, you take out a cell phone and dial 911. Now, do you have time or ability to explain where you are? No. Let's say you are kidnapped and you have a cell phone with you, which is your only hope to escape. When the kidnapper is diverted for a second, you dial 911. Now, can you explain about your location? No. How many lives have we lost when even after calling 911, People didn't get help immediately because emergency service couldn't arrive in time because they had problems figuring out the exact locations of the 911 callers. How wonderful would it be if a kidnapped person could be localized immediately and automatically? Even Federal Communications Commission realized the importance of automatic source localization in 1996. And do you know that our mobile operators are required to localize any 911 caller with an accuracy of 100 meters in 67% of the calls? The issuance of this mandate triggered the research and development in the field of mobile source localization. The mobile operators are doing all they can to make sure that they achieve these requirements. Initially, they had no idea how to achieve those requirements. Now, they need a tool with which they can evaluate their performance, with which they can determine if they can meet those FCC requirements. My thesis was focused on developing that tool for the wireless carriers. I took mobile source localization as a wireless communication theory problem. Now, for any given scenario, I can predict how well source localization can be done. I can specify the radius within which a 911 caller can be localized. Now the performance can be different for different scenarios, but with my tool, the performance can be predicted for any scenario. And I can also predict how the performance changes with different factors in the, in the environment. So with my tool in hand, the wireless carriers can now take a deep sigh of relief and make sure that they comply with the FCC mandate so that every 911 caller gets the help that he or she deserves in time. Thank you.